Welcome to another video on vocabulary. This time we are going to concentrate on ordinal numbers. How do you indicate the order in English? So here we go. Which minion is the first to arrive to the party? Yes, this one is the first. And this one is the second. This one is the third. The fourth the fifth and the sixth. So, what do you notice? Yes, when we speak about orders, we need to change the numbers. We don't say one, two, three. Now, we are going to use different words. So, for one, two, three, we have to change first, second and third. But check out the following ones. You say fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth, ninth, tenth. So, as simple as saying th. Check this out. Eleventh, twelfth, thirteenth, fourteenth, fifteenth, sixteenth, seventeenth, eighteenth, nineteenth, and twentieth. So, you have to remember first, second, and third. And then, th. From then on, it's the same thing. Now, for 21, 22, 23, the rule goes 1 to 3. So, you say 21st, 22nd, 23rd. But then, 24th, 5th, etc., etc. And for 30, 40, 50, etc., you change a little bit and you say 30th, 40th, 50th, and on and on, and so on and on. You get it? So, let's practice a little bit. Who remembers who were the first football champions? Nope. Yes. The first world football champions were Uruguay in 1930. Who was the second man on the moon? Second man on the moon? Yes, Buzz Aldrin. Neil Armstrong was the first one. What do we call this spot between your eyes? Okay, yes, the third eye. The name of this movie with Bruce Willis speaking to dead people, Sixth Sense. Yes. And this one, another movie with an ordinal number again with Bruce Willis, The Fifth Element. Good memory. Okay. When did God rest? On the seventh day. Yes. So, as simple as that, little thing of memory. See you next time.